Stadium in Atlanta, Georgia. It's week three of the NFL on EA Sports. as always to be bringing you coverage of the National Football League on EA Sports. We thought the old place was loud. Somehow this place got even louder a short time ago as the Falcons were introduced to this sellout crowd. We're set to go as the Falcons get ready to match up with the Chicago Bears. and 10 it's Trubisky and this is caught it's Jimmy Graham and they'll get it up just short of the 45 at the 44 19 yards there on the catch and run a gain of well, I haven't met an NFL player yet that doesn't use criticism as an edge and Jimmy Graham has heard that a number of people think he's near the end of his career and he didn't put up the numbers he should have put up in Green Bay with Aaron Rodgers I think he's going to play with a huge chip on his shoulder. Nice catch there. He wants to show flashes of that form that he exhibited early in his career with New Orleans and Seattle. That good for 21 yards on the catch and run. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. Trubisky's throw pulled in by Robinson. And he's got this down almost to the 20 before he's dropped. Another good gain. That's now 35 yards combined on those last two plays. And the Bears first down. They will run for the first time with David Montgomery. And he's taken down after a gain of three as they move it from the 22 to the 19. Taken down at the 19-yard line. The numbers on the ground for Montgomery in last week's affair. 16 carries, 75 yards, and a touchdown. Well, watching the film, we saw that things clicked pretty well for them in the running game last week. No reason to change in my mind. Continue to try and run the football. Give it to them early and often. And They'll run for the first time with Tariq Cohen. And the result here, a pickup of eight. Leaves him with two to go on second down. He's taken down. They'd love to just strike back with a touchdown right here. And if it's a long play, so be it. But the main goal, get a couple of first downs. Run some plays, run some clock. Allow their defense to get a chance to catch their breath. Settle down and relax a little bit after they just gave up a score. So that'll back him up five. Now after the false start, here's second and seven. Throwing here, Trubisky. He'll find Miller, that's complete. And they work this well upfield across the 45. That one, a gain of 20 and a first down. First down, Bears. A play fake to Montgomery, now Trubisky. He's going to take off with it. He's got the first down and more inside the 40. And finally taken down at the 30-yard line. That one good for 21 yards. And it'll give him a fresh set of downs. These two teams all tied after one. Seven to seven. This will be stopped about two yards shy of the marker. Eight and in two. He was taken That's a really nice job by them picking up the run blitz and detecting it and blocking it and turning it into a nice run. And a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother it. But a lot of the blitzers, they come in a little bit high. They don't have great leverage, and they're easily blocked and turned to the side. And he gets it inside the 10 to the 9. The Bears on the move. They've got another first down. They'll run with Montgomery. 
And a nice pick up there as he'll take it from the 10 down to the five yard line. Tackle me. Five yards remain on second down. Brings up second and goal. And they try again with Montgomery. And he will push his way forward down to about the three yard line. And a nice job defensively to keep him out of the end zone. He's trying to get a second touchdown already in the first half. They had that one earlier. He was bidding for a second. And he's got his man. That's Robinson. Touchdown, Bears. Allen Robinson. Play action. Now Trubisky. That's caught by Montgomery. They call it no gain there on the first down play. Well, that was a simple throw and catch, but even with that completion, zero yards gained, so they're behind schedule on down and distance. I think they were hoping to get it to him. He could make a man or two miss, but that window closed quickly. On the move to his left. He'll end up getting five out of that, but now they're looking at third down. A five-yard pickup on the play, and it's third down. Now it's Trubisky. And he'll complete this one to Patterson. And he's got the first, but we also have a flag on the field. And they're already walking backwards. So a decent gain, but all for naught on the penalty. It's too bad, isn't it? They were feeling pretty good about it. The only people celebrating, the guys who just gave up that play. Now Trubisky on third and long, and that is incomplete. And that could be the stop this defense needed to get them back on track. They've been pretty well dissected by the offense here in the first half. After that possession, now they know that they can compete with this offense. The call for a fair catch, and it's made at about the 23-yard line. Looking to throw Trubisky on first down. Got a man. It's Patterson complete. Complete to Cordero Patterson. Well, it's time for them to be good teammates right here. And what I mean by that is possess the ball for a little while. Get at least two first downs. Give their defense a chance to settle down a little bit after they give up a touchdown. Now a man open down the middle of the field. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. Now Trubisky on first down. But one of the ways the quarterbacks keep all the receivers alive in a play, never lock in on any one guy. Make sure you keep your eyes moving, scan the field. And here he finds the open guy for a nice pickup. He has just been alone for a point. going to run it here up the middle and he'll just push his way forward for a few as the clock will run he's tackled and they'll work from the 29 on second it's and we will skip They'll start things on first with Torrey Cohen. And he'll get this up past the 45 to the 47. It's a six-yard pickup, but it gets him to second and four. It's a pickup of six. Brings up second and four. Back to the ground, this time Montgomery. He's got a first down and then some inside the 40. And he'll get this down to the 39-yard line. Give him 14 on that one and a first down. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. From the gun, it's Trubisky. It's complete to Robinson. A good pick up there, eight yards on the first down completion. Now after the completion, we're gonna get a timeout, an injured player. While the training staff takes a peek, we'll take a break. To throw again on second down, 
Trubisky. He completes this into the hands of Miller. Trubisky. And he'll be a couple yards shy of the red zone here at the 22-yard line. And that one, a first down pickup of eight. First down. On first down, Trubisky. They'll roll it. Up. And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. Brady Jarrett able to drop him for a loss of four from his defensive tackle spot. So after the sack, here's second and 14. From the shotgun is Trubisky. He gets it complete to Harris. And they'll bring him down at the 13-yard line. It's a pickup of 12, and that'll set up a third down. And it's third down. On third and one, it's Trubisky. The third down battle won by Atlanta's defense. Begin the drive on the ground with Cohen. And he's upended after a gain of two out to the 27. The ball carrier. Certainly a nice job there by the defense rallying to the football and getting him on the ground. But I think the play gets made by the defensive front. Because if they can't get upfield, their job is to go ahead and get low, almost get into a ball sometimes, stack things up, and make it difficult for the runner to find a hole. Anthony Miller. A gain of nine yards. First down Bears. They'll throw on first down with Trubisky. Completes it to Miller. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. Right back to him for 10 more and a first. Back now here on EA Sports. It's Bears football, but they trail on the scoreboard as we get set to bring you the fourth quarter. Out of the gun, Trubisky. Over the middle, he gets it to Patterson. And taking it across midfield and just shy of the 40. Another nice gain, 13 yards that time and another first down. First down, Chicago. Looking to throw again, Trubisky. He'll leave it for Cohen, complete. And brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. The catch and run, good for eight. and a first down. And the Bears first down. Trubisky to throw again. And he finds his tight end, Graham. And they work this near the five. He'll be stopped at the six. Another nice gain, 16 yards there at a first down again. That catch in his career is number 662, and that's significant because it ties him with Hall of Famer Ozzie Newsom. Yeah, who was a wide receiver at Alabama. Before he... And Miller will pull this one in. He's got it for the Bears' touchdown. Complete to Anthony Miller. Anthony Miller. Here's Trubisky. He's going to dump that off to his running back, Cohen. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. The catch and run, good for 18 and a first down. One play has him up past the 40 already and another first and 10. Here's Trubisky to throw, and this is intercepted, and that should do it. Picked off at the 49. Intercepted. If they had designs of kind of wiggling their way back into this one, that hurts their chances right there. They had to put it mildly. We look at the lead, look at the deficit, trying to make a play downfield. Everyone seeking to be...
A lot of scoring. There's no doubt about that in this one, Charles. Points, they were not at a premium. They were pretty easy to come by. <laughs> they were, but it was fun, wasn't it? Because both teams finding ways to click. And you know people who love this game. They also love baseball games that are 14 to 11 with three or four home runs mixed in. So for the Falcons, it's an ideal start as they move to 3-0 now on the young season. And they will hit the road next week for a date with the Green Bay Packers. Meanwhile, for the Bears, they'll fall to 1-2. And, and they'll have a chance at redemption next week at home against the Indianapolis Colts. That'll do it for us. I'm Brandon Gordon, alongside Charles Davis. Thanks to our entire crew as well. We'll talk to you next time. So long, everybody.